Good morning, I'm Cora. And I'm Ethan S. Welcome to WTCE News. Today is Friday, October 7th, and it's our 44th day of school. When we say to pledge, everyone needs to stop talking, stop walking, stand, cover your heart, and join us. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now it is time for a life goal pledge. Everyone, please repeat after me. I will treat people right. I will treat people right. I will do the right thing. I will do the right thing. I am a Trojan. I am a Trojan. A Trojan is strong. A Trojan is strong. A Trojan is smart. A Trojan is smart. Today I will show others that I am a Trojan. Today I will show others that I am a Trojan. Today for lunch we are having ham and cheese calzone, cheesy potatoes, mixed veggies, applesauce and milk. Happy birthday today to Emmett C. Over the weekend, Claire H. will be celebrating. Please go to the office for a pencil and a birthday wish. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! Today we have a new, we have a new lifeline for October. It is responsibility. It means to respond when appropriate and to be accountable for your actions. I take responsible responsibility for my messes. If I drop something or I, or spill something in the cafeteria, I clean it up. I do not leave the mess for Mr. Pace. Do you clean up after yourself in the cafeteria? We have just we have just learned the fifth graders have some breaking news. about two or four year degrees that you earn in college. Those are called associate's degrees and bachelor degrees. After receiving your bachelor's degree, you can go back to college again. If you go to college for two more years, you earn your master's degree. That's a total of six years in college. A lot of people go back to college to get their master's degree for a lot of different reasons, like getting a different job, moving up their job like a promotion, or simply because they want to become more knowledgeable. No matter what the reason, going going back to get your master's degree is always an option. Today we are going to talk to Mrs. Farrell about their master's degree. Thank you for joining us. Today we have Miss Farrell and we have a few questions for you about College Co Week. So the first question is, where did you go to college and why did you pick that college? I went to Indiana University in Bloomington to get my bachelor's and I chose that college because it's a beautiful campus and my sister was there and I majored in psychology and they have a great psychology department. And then I went to Purdue to transition to teaching and then I went to Ball State to get my master's. The second question is, what did you earn your degree in? I already answered that, didn't I? I got a bachelor's in psychology and a master's in education. The third question is, what was one of your favorite things about college? One of my favorite things about college was meeting people from all over the state, all over the United States, and all over the world, and just getting their perspective on things and things that they were able to do that I hadn't done and just learning from each other. The fourth question is, what was your favorite class that you took in college? My favorite class was a sensory and perception class where you learned about all the ways that your eyes um, take in information and how your brain processes that. The fifth question is, any advice that you would give to, any advice you would like to give to the students? 
My advice would be once you get to college, if you have picked a major and you decide that you don't want to do that anymore, change your major. Okay? Even if that adds a year, if you end up going five years or six years, that's just a little bit of time um, considering you have to do what you're going to do the rest of your life. So make sure that you get into something that you enjoy. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you. I went to Indiana State University and I picked that college because they are known for teaching and I also got to be part of their marching sycamores, the marching band. What did you, what did you earn your degree in? I earned my degree in elementary education with a minor in special education and also in reading curriculum. What was one of your favorite things about college? My absolute favorite thing about college was being able to be Indiana State University's uh, feature twirler for all four years. And I actually brought twirling back to my university and nobody was twirling before me for 10 years. So it was really cool to do that. What was your favorite class you took in college? I think my favorite class could have been um, an English class for elementary education. And we got to make a book and we had to create the pictures and we also had to create the words and the plot twists and all that. Any advice you like to give to any of the students? Have fun, um, do your best, and go for what you want. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thanks fifth graders for the, for the import, important information. Now back to our news. Fall break is coming up October 17th through October 20th. Please let your, let your grown up know that we are having school next week, but the week after that we'll be we will be home be at home all week. Liberty Liberty Leaders 4 H Club will be having a call call out meeting for anyone that, that would like to join on Thursday, October thirteenth at third at three o'clock in Miss Chagrister's class. Make sure you have someone to pick you up after the meeting. Come join 4-H and find out all about all of all about all the fun of the fun activities. Now it is now it is time for a Friday Funnies. Why do hummingbirds hum? Oh, I know this one. To this one, the reason hummingbirds hum is because they do not know how. They don't know words. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching us on announcements. Have a fantastic Friday and a wonderful weekend. Now let's get our day started. Please say a little motto along with us. Treat people right and do the right thing and you'll have peace.